but the best way to, to not necessarily trick a cat is make it feel good to them. Um, they're not going to let you just do something to them. They're different. <laughs> now, see, I am not, I am holding her down, but I'm more than anything, I'm rolling her skin where it's tight. Not stretched, but it's tight. And then you test your blade on your arm, not your hand. And she's squirming, so. And the other, you, right here is an easy cut area. The flank, that skin is real thin and it's, I know. So you want to like roll it or pull it, stretch it where there's not that little wrinkle like, so to speak. And I believe she's, she's saying her time's up. Her 15 minutes didn't last long. Do you notice that I'm like brushing with the blade? And none of them like for you to do their rear. So you like hold them up here and then, and don't think you're gonna clip her whole leg. Just think you're gonna clip about an inch, you know, and that's the way you to do it. Otherwise you will have a mess on your hands with her in future grooming or cutting her. And see how she's, she wants down. What you do on cats, which is just the opposite on dogs, you let them down or they just go berserk, you know? I believe that they stress out more than a dog does. And then it's after the bath that you get them all nice and neat. This is called rough skin. You just mostly get off what you can. And see how I'm holding her back like that? Okay, that's to stretch her stomach. And I'm gonna stop there because there's that skin. And if it takes you a long time on a cat, that is very normal. I mean, there's usually not a fast way to do that. You have to do it their way. <laughs> you with cats know that applies not only in grooming, just about everything else they do. So you remember, straight down the back bone and then flare it off like an, an arrowhead. And then real careful around the legs and wherever the folds are. And she is thoroughly put out with me right now. So we're gonna let her have a break. She did pretty good to have never had it done. <laughs>